Need no introduction. This is where you can see Stonehenge without paying. <laughs> You can see for nothing on four times a year anyway. So they're all roped off here. Paid to get here. They waited a bit longer. You can just walk in and touch the stones with us. On the winter solstice. The rough it. Over there. On the drive. The fires, but it's worth it. Jimmy oh. on Halloween. Great things on Halloween. Especially in Abbey, linked to Stonehenge by ley line. So, my wish is to get in there on Halloween. I've just been around, chucked loads of business cards out to everybody. All the people in the drive, the visiting centre, they all are. That's from one specially made up for Stonehenge. Excuse the dirty thumbnails. Stone Engine Anomalies, four minutes as a time machine with aliens in, don't laugh. Stone Engine Visitors, there's UFO at the end with all white dots. Jake! And there's one minute 48, there's a blue alien with Bobby's lips. That's Stone Engine, give me a sign, the pyramid's turned up. Jake! The sheep alone! Colourful pictures in that. Stone Engine Strangeness at the end is wild. Mystery Oars with faces in them. Jake! Avery Activities, Wild, called the Grim Reaper there, launched in America. That's the last winter saltus. Wood ends woo woos. <laughs> and I smashed Halloween. And Avery's most haunted for life. Like. I get spirits come to me all the time, I call them everywhere. I had major captures again last night. Just around the doorway, the entrance there, back entrance. All around the stone and sign and everything. So tonight I should do really well. Yeah, it was a bit foggy in Ivory, so I couldn't do a lot there. Couldn't go back, so I'll try and do it again on the way back. my guards are there. So hopefully English Heritage will wake up and discuss what I catch in Stonehenge. Because their attitude is if there's anything going on then we should know about it first. So I'm joining in like. Come in mate. I must just stand on the side of the fence. Right. Lie out of the landscape. Small tourists. 